Hello everybody, my name is Fire Centaur from English Village and Second Life Link for Facebook. My name is Paul Prabish in the real world and I'm coming to you live from English Village playing to you a nice little tune at our English Village nightclub. Today I wanted to show you uh, quickly our new authentication technique for Second Life Link for Facebook and hopefully this uh, new technique will uh, speed things up for you when you're registering for our application. Now the way that uh, our new application works is uh, we have several uh, robots uh, logged in here at English Village. They're actually um, avatars and uh, what they do is um, when you um, go to authenticate your uh, avatar uh, with our Facebook application our robot will get a message and it will send you an instant message with an authentication technique. Now, uh, authentication URL. Now, it sounds a bit complicated, so let me just show you what I mean. First of all, let me show you how to do it. On our island here, we've got a directory and there's a terminal link. So if you click on this terminal, you're going to teleport to the Second Life link area. So let's do that. Okay, I'm teleporting now. I've disappeared and here we are. Now I'm standing in front of the Second Life link terminal. Now what this terminal does when you click it is it actually just gives you a link to our uh, application. Uh, before it actually did some fancy stuff but now if you click on it all you're going to get is a menu and it says help and join. And when you click help what you're going to do is you're going to get a, uh, a uh, note card that tells you how to do all this. But if you click join, it's just going to give you a message in your chat that gives you a link to our website, which is apps.facebook.com slash second life. Now, when you click on this link, and by the way, it just says as of May 20th, 2008, we are beta testing a streamlined version of our registration system, blah, blah, blah. So if you click on this link, uh, apps.facebook.com slash second life, the Second Life, uh, sorry, the uh, Second Life media browser is going to uh, load up, and it's going to take you to Facebook. Now, if you've already got a Facebook account, you can simply log in um, over to the left here with your password. Um, or if you don't have a Facebook account, you've got to create one. So let's just. I'm going to also open this up in my web browser just so that it's a little bit easier to see. So I'm going to click on that and what's going to happen is my Firefox is going to load up. Yes, I do use Firefox. I think it's an awesome web browser. And um, what you're going to do is uh, it's going to say sign up and use Second Life Link on Facebook. So let's enter in your full name. So I'm just going to enter in, actually I've already got uh, an account on Facebook. So I'm just going to enter in a test one just for test uh, purposes. So I'm going to put test. Pribish. My last name is Pribish. And then I'm going to put, okay, I am at a company. Date of birth, December 4th, 1974. I'm not too shy about my age. I teach kids every day, so they always ask me, how old are you? Okay, I'm going to type in fire at eslteacherlink.co.kr. That's one of my email addresses that I use. And I'm going to put a password in here. Okay. And then I'm going to type in the CAPTCHA code. I am dash. I hope this is where I, I always get them wrong. Braille man. Okay, let's see if this works. I have read and agree to the terms of use and privacy policy. Now you guys should probably check out the terms of use and privacy policy of Facebook um, before you create an account. And then it says by adding Second Life Link I agree to the platform terms of use of Second Life Link terms of service. So we also have our terms of service down here so you can click on that and, and take a look at that as well. Okay sign up. And then let's see if it actually, oops, let's just see if it works. If I did entered my CAPTCHA incorrectly, probably didn't. Cross your fingers. It's loading, it's loading. Now, if you're having trouble signing up for a Facebook account, 
I recommend you do a quick Google search for signing up for a Facebook account. I did this and I found a really good link uh, by a guy named FB Ninja and he goes through everything from signing up to uh, signing up your name, selecting a network, selecting a category and uh, his video is quite good so check it out. He'll tell you how to sign up for a Facebook account and once you've got that all done you can log into our application. The first step would be to type in apps dot facebook dot com slash second dash life and if you press enter that will take you to this page and here it gives you some options on adding our application Hey, congratulations. If you've made it this far, that's awesome because this is where the fun begins. Okay, this is our Second Life link registration form. And here, let's take a look at the README. It says, please enter your Second Life name below and press submit. Our service avatar will then send a name confirmation URL to your Second Life avatar. If you are currently in Second Life, please simply check your chat messages and click on the link that was sent to you and complete your verification. Enter your SL name below. So I'm going to type in, okay, first I'm going to check to see if I'm in Second Life. Yes, I am. Here's my avatar. You actually don't have to be in Second Life because messages will be sent directly to your email. Um, they'll be relayed by the Second Life servers. So I'm just going to go back to Facebook. I'm going to type in Fire Centaur. And now you can click Sync Second Life Link Account. Now I'm going to jump back into uh, Second Life and I'm going to click on my uh, Communicate button. And that's going to bring up uh, my chat windows and you can see my contacts list, my group chat. And here it is, S-Link Robonaut. He's one of our bots. I'm going to show you him in a minute. Um, you can see there's a message. It says, hello, I'm a registration bot from Second Life Link. Paul Privish is trying to link their Facebook profile with this Second Life avatar, Fire Centaur. If you are not Paul Privish, and then it has um, a link to your Facebook um, profile of Paul Privish in real life, please disregard this message. Otherwise, click the following URL to complete registration. So if you click on the URL, this should bring up um, the media browser in in Second Life. Now sometimes if you haven't logged in to Facebook through the media browser you'll have to log in to Facebook first but if you have done that already it'll say success congratulations you have now linked your Second Life ID to your Facebook profile and if you click on here it'll take you to Second Life link so congratulations this is Second Life link so we hope this application will be useful to you. Um, we know it's definitely useful for us in managing our contacts. Um, I really like it because um, here it has a list of all my uh, friends in, in Second Life who have added our application. It lists their Second Life name and their real life name. So if I click on, on this person, it'll actually take me to her profile in, in Facebook and I could send her a message, send her a video message or whatnot. And um, if I... Uh, um, it also tells um, us her online status in Second Life, so this can help you coordinate virtual meetings better. Or you can just jump into Second Life and, and start talking to, to them. So we hope that can help you that way. And you can also specify your favorite uh, home location, your favorite, um, favorite destination. We also have a community tab, and this community tab is really neat uh, because when you click on it, um, it'll give you a list of our members who are currently in Second Life and it'll give you, if you put a mouse over on them, it'll tell you their Second Life name and if they've set their privacy settings to allow you to see their Facebook profile, if I click on this, it'll actually take me to this person's Facebook profile and I could send them a Facebook message. Now, if you click on the My Profile tab, this is where you can upload an image um, so you have an image instead of a question mark for your avatar on our application. And you can also specify your um, favorite home location and also specify your privacy settings. And we also have a friend finder. This will allow you to find friends in Second Life and send them an invitation to use our application. Last but not least, we also have a discussions tab. 
And if you click on that, you can post questions and, and ideas that you might have for us so that um, we can possibly integrate into future versions. And uh, we also have a fan page. Our fan page is called Second Life Link Facebook Application Updates. And if you subscribe to this, um, every time we post an update to our application, you will see receive a Facebook message saying that there's been an update. So anyways, I'd just like to uh, personally thank you for uh, trying out our application in uh, for Second Life in Facebook. And we really hope that it will help you to uh, manage your contacts better and to spread the good word of the emerging metaverse. Talk to you soon. This is Fire Centaur from English Village signing out. Oh, I just remembered. I wanted to show you the bot. The bot that does all the hard work here. Let me take you down. He's hiding below in the ocean. He's lurking below. Let me take you down. Where is he? Oh, I see somebody. Oh, there's somebody else. They fell down, looks like. Where's my bot? Come on, S-Link. Where are you? Oh, I see somebody. Ah, there you are. Okay, good. So here is S-Link Robonaut. He's the, he's the robot that does all the work. Every time uh, uh, an avatar registers on our Second Life uh, link application, he sends you an instant message. Anyways, I'll seriously sign out this time. Talk to you later. It's 4 a.m. here. Bye-bye.